Hi friends, it's so nice to see you this evening for our good night friends. I'm reading from Night Night Devotions from Amy Parker. The Big No-No The man said, You gave this woman to me. She gave me fruit from the tree, so I ate it. Genesis chapter 3 verse 12 When you get caught in a big no-no, what do you do? Do you hide? Do you blame it on someone else? Or do you immediately admit it and say, I'm sorry? In the first big no-no of the Bible, Adam and Eve did two of those things. First, they hid. Mm -hmm. And then they blamed it on someone else. When God asked Adam what happened, Adam blamed it on Eve. She gave me fruit from the tree. It even sounds like Adam blamed it on God when he pointed out that God gave this woman to him. Then when God asked Eve about it, she said, The snake tricked me. Genesis chapter 3 verse 13. It's kind of silly when you think about it. The only person who made Adam's decision was Adam. And the only person who made Eve's decision was Eve. When we do something wrong, it's usually tough to admit it, isn't it? It's a lot easier to blame it on someone else. To say it was someone else's fault. But I bet you already know the right thing to do. When someone does something, when you do something wrong, admit it, say, I'm sorry. And then try to never do that thing again. The best part is, no matter what you do, when you ask God to forgive you, his answer is always yes. Let's pray. Thank you, God, for giving me, for forgiving me. When I do something wrong, Help me to be kind and good and to always get along. Night, night, God. Do you need to ask forgiveness for something? Talk to God right now and talk to him about it. Good night, friends.